Hi, I'm Randy Reed. It's Today in Light and Friday, 1 December. We're sponsored by White Goods, one and a half inch aperture Pro Tools downlights for general and accent illumination. If you enjoy Today in Lighting, please do hit the like button. Here are the stories making news. George McLean has been appointed as the new president of Sonapar Canada, effective March 2024. He is succeeding Francois Octil, who will retire after a successful 36-year career at the company. The December edition of Bill Atardi's Energy Watch newsletter has been released. You can view it at edisonreport.com. Discover Juan Davlia's insights into the future of lighting technology. Juan dives into the potential of quantum dots, nanophosphors, nanowires, and graphene in creating efficient, high-performing LED lighting solutions. Full article at designinglighting.com. Aicha Donuhi, LIA's CEO for a year now, shares strides in team commitment, engagement, and industry collaboration. Her tenure saw new hires, expanded social media outreach, successful events, and advocacy for health. Signify received Echo Vetus's highest platinum rating for the fourth consecutive year, placing it among the top 1% of assessed companies. Learn more about Signify's sustainability efforts on designinglightingglobal.com. Check out Stones River Electric's president, Rob Wilson's journey chronicled in LM&M. From unexpected encounters with Don King during his electrician days to steering energy conservation projects today. Yesterday, the Dow was up 520 points. That's the high of the year. NASDAQ dropped 32 points, and Signify was up about 1%. That's it. Go light up the world. Have a great weekend. Pray for peace.